Hello everyone, welcome back to Fox Tech. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use Snapdrop on your iPhone and computer. If you're not familiar with Snapdrop, it's a fantastic alternative to AirDrop, allowing easy file transfers across all devices on a local network, not just Apple devices. Let's get started and explore how this works. First, let's talk a bit about what Snapdrop is. Snapdrop is a file transfer service similar to AirDrop. The key difference is that Snapdrop isn't limited to Apple devices. It works across all devices, making it a versatile tool for sharing files on a local network. This is great for those times when you need to transfer files between an iPhone and a non-Apple device, or when AirDrop isn't an option. Snapdrop provides a simple user-friendly interface. You can access it via snapdrop.net or through a Chrome extension. It's designed to be intuitive, making file transfers straightforward and hassle-free. Now, let's dive into the actual steps of using Snapdrop. First, make sure both your iPhone and computer are connected to the same local network. This is crucial for Snapdrop to work. Open a web browser on both your iPhone and your computer and go to snapdrop.net. You can use any computer, whether it's a Mac or a PC. If you're using a Mac, you might typically use AirDrop, but Snapdrop is perfect for cross-platform transfers. Once you're on the Snapdrop website, um, you should see both devices recognized by one another. On your iPhone screen, you'll see an icon representing your computer. Tap on this icon and you'll be prompted to choose a file or photo to share. Select the file some the file ki yoku wants son keen so dot son the chart row you form right as there sounds and sorry news transfer and the process will begin. On your computer, you'll receive a notification that a file is being sent. Once the transfer is complete, you can save the file to your desired location on your computer. It's that simple. This process works both ways, so you can also send files from your computer to your iPhone just as easily. Snapdrop uses WebRTC for secure, encrypted transfers within the local network, ensuring that your files are safe during the transfer. Additionally, Snapdrop offers features like system notifications and a dark mode, enhancing the user experience. The service is quite reliable and the transfer speed is decent, making it a viable option for most file sharing needs. It's particularly useful when AirDrop fails or isn't available, providing a seamless alternative. So what do you think? Would you give Snapdrop a try yourself? It's a handy tool that bridges the gap between different devices, making file transfers smooth and efficient. And that's how you use Snapdrop on your iPhone and computer. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to Fox Tech C for more tech tutorials and tips. Thank you for watching. Peace.